So two years ago, you were in a wheelchair paralyzed from the waist down. Yes. And uh, now not only are you out of that wheelchair and walking, you're dancing. Yes. This is, how, what? I mean, that's how, my response as well. Like, yeah. What? <laughs> okay, so because it, you were 11 when when this, what, what happened exactly at 11? I developed two incredibly rare neurological conditions called transverse myelitis and acute disseminated encephalomyelitis, which basically my body attacked my brain and my spinal cord. And I went misdiagnosed, and so I lost every ability, every ability possible and slipped into a vegetative state and was pretty much written off as a lost cause. Right, so vegetative state is different than a coma, I learned this morning. Yes. So you're, you were, it seemed you were not there, and people would think you're not there, but you're a ve you, you can there. hear everything, you yes. can see everything, you just couldn't respond. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's gotta be so frustrating to not be able to say, I'm here. Yes, and you wouldn't believe how, what people say when they think you're not there especially um, doctors and stuff. So I had to kind of find that inner, inner fight within me. But I have an amazing family that just loved me tremendously. And I just had so much life I wanted to live. So I, w I wasn't done yet. So I didn't really care what the doctors were saying. I was pretty set on living and, and not just living, but, but really making every moment count. And how long did that go for? That was about four years. Four years. Okay. So were you were you watching? Like, did you watch Dancing with the Stars? Did you always, did you see the show and think, I'll be on there one day. <laughs> when I was 10, I actually told my mom that I was gonna be on the show, but I was five when I told her I was gonna win a gold medal. So she just kind of put it on my, my list of my bucket list of things I wanted to do. And then we never imagined what would happen Obviously, Especially a year that. later, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and um, and so it was always just this fun goal. But she also put the Ellen Show on when I was really sick. So she put Dancing with the Stars and the Ellen Show on to like keep these, keep it light, keep it full of love. And um, and so I just kind of kept my eye, eye on the eye on the prize, and just kept reminding myself, okay, Victoria, if you get through one more day, you're one step closer to to achieving all of that. Unbelievable. <laughs> it's. I mean, this story is unbelievable. <laughs> <laughs> Val, this is, this is your 13th season. Yes. And, and I mean, this has to be, if, you know, you can't really diminish other partners you've had, but it's like, this has to be really special. special. It, it, is, it is incredibly special. And uh, I'm incredibly grateful that Dancing with the Stars trusted me with this incredible <laughs> miracle. Uh, and I'm, I'm treating it as, as, as my own miracle as well. You know, I'm, I'm doing my very best to give her the time of her life. And, and she's been through so much. So I, I just hope I can deliver on that. I think yeah. you are. I think yeah. you are. Yeah. And wait, can I ask you a question? Because I heard this, and I don't know if this is true or what this even means, that you can't feel your, your you've only been walking for about a year, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, <laughs> can, could you that. feel that? No. You can't feel your legs? Not at all. How can you dance if you can't feel your legs? You can, <laughs> how do you know where you are with moving your legs? Well, I think that was the, the most challenging part. Even just with walking, it was right, left, right, left, and I had to keep telling myself that. And so when I signed on to do the show, there was kind of like, oh, I have to not only go right, left, but I have to turn and look up and, and stay graceful. But I think the coolest thing about Val is he believes in me way more than and I believed in myself when it came to this. That's amazing. That's amazing. All right. Head on over. I can't wait to see this. Thank you. Thank you.
So I gave you some more underwear, right? Yes, please. And I know that you like uh, chucks, right? Yeah. So I got you some high tops, and I got you some chucks with my uh, face on it. Yes. Hey. yes. I got you underwear. Wow. <laughs> and the pink is your favorite color, right? Yes. All right, but I wanted to put mine in. All right, and also, I don't know, you might like my high tops too, so I got you some Ed by Ellen high tops, so you can oh, try those you. as well. Thank Dancing with the so Stars much. airs on Monday nights at 8 on ABC.